Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a brand new vlog. Thank you for tuning in. We have more packages, three massive parcels. I have a good idea what's in all of them. So we've got even more packages to open today. I'm going to kick off today actually by going to the gym. I haven't been to the gym, I'd say, in like a, a month. Something horrific like that. In 2016, I want to absolutely smash it, especially leading up to the summer. So we're going to be starting off today by hitting the gym, baby. I'm all ready, all dressed up. So let's kick it off. It's going to be a good day, so come along with me. Let's do this. Is it more than just your body? Alright, so we've arrived at the gym and the car park to get, like the free car parking for the gym, you go up a little bit of a ramp and I looked at it, I was like, that's steep, decided to go up it anyway and I definitely hit the front of my car a little bit. No! But anyway, I'm going to go to the gym, I'm going to try and go to the gym every single day from this point onwards. I know it's a big commitment, but I've done it before um, I want to do it again. I'm not going to vlog inside the gym today, but if you guys want to see what I get up to, all just little snippets, let me know. I've got a few things I've got to do after the gym, so for the moment it's gym time, baby. Time to get pumped up, listen to some set music, smash it! I have done the ultimate gym sin. I have not brought my headphones with me. This is gonna be this is gonna be a tough first session, man. No! Why? Boys, 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 gym session is over. It was a good first session. Went ahead and actually picked up some food for the cats. We actually feed them uh, actual raw food rather than like tinned or canned stuff. My car, the R8 is actually looking really, really dirty. Fun funny fact is that the black car seems to show up dirt worse than white. Like my A1 has not been cleaned in like six months. No, 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 that's a lie. Maybe maybe that's true actually. You can't really tell, it still looks alright, but Gym session, first session of 2016 is done. Time to feed the cats food that they'll actually eat because we've got some other one for them. They, they just don't eat it and open up some packages. Hey babies, how are you doing? I come with food that you should actually eat, hopefully. <laughs> Look at a lollipop. Say hello to everyone, beautiful. So it looks gross, I know. This is the fish. We've never fed them fish flavored one before. It's green and they hate it. And this is the new beef and chicken flavor. Look, it looks like meat, right? Rather than being green. So wait for that to defrost. It's like it's completely frozen and then we'll give them some foods. So I've never done this religiously or done it like a lot, but I want to do a little bit more. So obviously to gain muscle and to grow, having protein in your diet is really important. Often getting enough protein through just eating is not always easy. So I'm going to start tasting like some protein shakes. It's just like a bit of protein powder mixed with like milk or water. Simple, simple stuff. But I found uh, my little shaker and inside it is meant to be like a little metal ball that you shake around and then all the protein gets mixed in and it, it basically just works well as a mixer. I can't find it. I think someone's come along. See just this metal ball, thought it's like a part of a dishwasher and just throwing it away. And I was like, no, my mixer doesn't work anymore. And then I started going through cupboards. No, I had an ingenious idea. So here's just some of the stuff in our cupboards, right? And I was like, hmm, well, I can't find it. I can't find it. I was like, oh, wait a second. So weirdly enough, these little egg holders are actually the exact same thing that was in my shaker, except it's obviously in a different shape. So I'm gonna put this in and shake it up with this. And this should work instead. Hey! Now typically protein shakes taste, taste disgusting, so. It's actually not bad, it's like a vanilla flavour. It's good, it's good. I rate it. Solve the pro protein problem, my friends. We can go on with our day. Look what it is. It's Minecraft, boys. I haven't played Minecraft. Well, I have played Minecraft. I just haven't done Minecraft in a freaking age and I feel bad. So I'm actually on uh, aliacraft.net right here. And I'm in the arcade section. I think I'm going to try and play some Hunger Games. So if all goes to plan, there should have been a Hunger Games video the day before this vlog. So that's today's mission, my friends. Catch up on Minecraft. I also want to do a solo Minecraft series, but I'll talk to, talk to you guys to, about that in a future vlog. Uh, and I want to get Minecraft back on the channel, baby. So I hope you can smash some Hunger Games. So food wise today, I was going to make it, I've been having sandwiches, like massive sandwiches. You guys know my, my apple and cheese sandwich. And a few of you guys have tweeted me some pictures of you eating it and you enjoyed it. So I mean, honestly, get on it, guys. Cheese and apple is an awesome sandwich. But I decided, you know, I'm not really feeling any bread today. So I'm just going to make like a massive tonk salad with a load of chicken and just throw everything in there. And that should fill me up and uh, hopefully get me pumped for making videos for the rest of the day. So in these vlogs, I want to share things that I, people would just never see if, like, if I didn't do any vlogs, right? So one of the things I love doing on YouTube is making thumbnails, making them look as awesome as possible, learning new Photoshop skills, which is the program I use to make the thumbnails. And uh, one of the things I do a lot is this. So I'm in Photoshop right now. I'm actually designing a thumbnail for a new zombie series going off my main channel. So when it comes to making thumbnails, what I often do is make two versions of the thumbnail. So this is one option I've got. This is actually when you pack a punch, a shadow man appears just at the end of the ritual, but I've got the ray gun in hand. Or I've got this one, which is me firing off a shot with the ray gun. With, like some neck next level crazy green stuff going on. So normally if this vlog never happened, you'd only ever see one of these versions and I'm not sure which one it's gonna be. I think I'm gonna go for this one with the massive like green glow. But 
just thought I'd show you guys some of the decisions I have to make in the day. Honestly, like, not the hardest decision in the world, but just some of the work process that actually goes in behind making videos. Sometimes I'll edit a video in two different ways and choose one of the videos. Again, it just comes down to the thumbnails, the title. A lot of the times I'm doing multiple things and then choosing the best one to try and get the best video possible for you guys in every area. Be it thumbnail, title, editing, everything, everything, everything. So that's one of the decisions I've had to make. Yo, look at these rims. Man, are you mad? Now, see, I love my R8 as it is at the moment. Blacked out, black rims. Really, really nice, but I can't help it. I love these, like, thin spokes. So, like, minimum amount of spokes, really thin on a car. I think they look absolutely crazy. I don't really have the best cars in the world to show you an example of, but just look how mean they look. Like, it, oh, it transforms the car. So, I'm being a little bit cheeky and looking at rims at the moment. Maybe I'll get them from my R8. I don't know. You heard it here first. If it happens, I'll keep you guys updated. So, I actually have quite a busy week this week, which is Awesome, I'm gonna be going into London to do some filming and as she said, I don't think that's this week, I think it's next week. Doing some stuff with Monster, doing some very, very cool filming. So since I'm doing more of these daily vlogs, I'm gonna try and take you along uh, for those kind of things. The, the tree is still up by the way, apparently it's bad luck, but it just fills that space in the room really, really well. That's why it's still up. Now these two, they know what's about to happen, these two are ready. We've got the boxes there, got little Ollie Polly doing some lays down there. Darcy, what Darcy, what are you up to, bro? What, what are you up to over there, baby? You just you can't even see out the window there. I don't really know what you're up to. I feel like this table is just going to become the unboxing table, and it's just going to be like you can. I get sent a decent amount of stuff, and I've ordered a lot of stuff on Amazon, and some more stuff in here that I've ordered. Darcy, what have you? It's just Throwing pine cones around, being a nuisance. Darcy's the naughty one, but I love him. I absolutely love him. So let's open up this box and see what's inside, because I love opening packages, man. Darcy, you can't, baby. The camera isn't for you to eat and nom, all right? <laughs> Darcy wants to get involved. Darcy wants to steal the thunder. Darcy, Darcy, you can't knock the camera off. Jeez, man, what's he like? All right, the lighting in this room is absolutely shocking. We've got ourselves Toon Link, who I think looks absolutely awesome. I think this is a really cool character, and uh, I like him a lot. I played a little bit within Smash Bros. on the Wii, um, and I liked him. And obviously, Luigi, I just absolutely love anyway. I'm always the tall, lanky guy, so I always compare myself to, to Luigi out of the two Mario Brothers. And I got myself another stand. Just I really liked the stand last time. I think it's a great way to store them without just sort of like putting them on a shelf and just not having any order to it. Yo, I told you I was addicted. Man, I'm literally. Right, here we've got Ike here. I'm a massive fan, as I said, of the Fire Emblem series. So, trying to complete off the Fire Emblem squad there. We've got. Is this Bowser? Oh, boys, 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 chill out, box. Don't be falling on me. We've got ourselves Bowser, because he's an absolute badass character. And from what I'm, he was really good in the 3DS version. We used him a lot in the 3DS version, but just another awesome character all around. And then look at this. You can't go wrong with Pokemon characters. Lucario is an absolute badass. He's a fantastic Pokemon, fantastic fighter. And of course, we've got ourselves another. <laughs> Another stand. What? How many freaking stands did I order? I'm addicted, guys. Help me. Still got a, still got a third box to open. <laughs> All right, so the final one I actually just had this, which is not too bad. So obviously I like those stands, but I thought this was really cool. So it's actually a custom-made sort of like end of a level little figure that you can actually use to then put the amiibos on as well. So I thought that's just quite cool. Something a little bit different to display them. I have got more on the way. All right, guys. Not too many. This is like I, I'm gonna try and calm myself after this. But an awesome selection. Let's go put them on the shelf. One thing I always hate doing is actually taking these things out of their packets because the packaging looks so cool that I feel like I'm ruining it a little bit, but the toy's right, you gotta play with them. So this is a collection as it stands. I decided to put Luigi by himself, three Fire Emblem characters. We move back a stand. We've got Lucario and Charizard together, because of course they're from Pokemon. We've got Bowser and Link together. It's kind of annoying because look how low they're looking. It's quite hard to actually like get a good view of them. So maybe they really should go at the front. Yeah, I may move them around a little bit. Alright, final ordering now. We've got Lucario, Charizard, Pokemon at the front with Bowser and Luigi, because Bowser's like badass, so low, but like if you put him far back, you can't really see it. But all the swordsmen here together decided to link uh, link with them. And and then we've got Mario at the back. The reason I haven't put Mario with Luigi is because if you look at the stand, that will tell you what game it's from or what sort of like theme it's a part of. So that stand means it's from uh, Super Smash Bros. And that stand means it's just the general Mario uh, amiibo. And we've got two Animal Crossing characters at the back there. So this is our collection, baby. This is looking good. And just as we thought the fun was all over for today, and this package was due to come today, I just didn't think it was. It's quite late. I'm actually editing this vlog right now. Knock at the door, and we've got another package. I'm just going to open this one right here for you guys. I know what it, I'm pretty sure I know what it is. 
Yeah, boy. Yo. So this one is the Pikachu. Yo, the lighting's sick. I'll show you the, the light in a sec. This is the Pikachu Smash Bros. Amiibo. And this is actually going to fill up the final spot that we have currently in the stand. This is awesome. So this is the light I use when I'm recording so that my face looks nice and, and clear and crisp. But if, if I show you sort of the screen, you can see stuff going on here. Then go up and you can see that there. So that is awesome. All right, I'm actually going to do a little bit of rearranging. Pikachu is just so freaking awesome. I'm actually going to put Luigi all the way back there with Mario and keep Pikachu at the front right here. Of course, shiny Pikachu, baby. You know that I got that the other day. This is oh, such a cute little character. So there we go. That's actually the perfect amount of Amiibos for what we've got here. And uh, it finishes off our day of Amiibo madness perfectly. So as I said, I'm actually editing this vlog right now. It's just a little bit of bonus footage. So thank you so much, guys, for watching another vlog. Hopefully, you've really enjoyed it. We're getting like over 10,000 over 15,000 on my last car vlog, 20,000 likes, which is just absolutely awesome. I cannot thank you guys enough. And as I said, I've got a few cool things going on this week. So the vlogs will switch up. I won't just be based in my house a lot. So it should be a lot more cool things. So thank you for watching. You guys are awesome. And I'll see you guys on another vlog.